So, what do you see? I see one, two, three, four, five, six carbons. I also see one, two, three, four, five, six carbons. So I'm going to arrange these carbons so that the fourth one here is going to interact with the first one here. And this, when, it, when it's combined, will be a disaccharide, which is a carbohydrate. So if you notice, look at the model. Here's the linear form of glucose. Here's the cyclic one. So you see one, two, three, four, five, and six. So four of this one will interact with the one of another one. So let's look at it. Here's glucose and fructose that makes sucrose. Here's glucose and another glucose. That's what I'm going to demonstrate. So you'll see one, two, three, four. So here's four right here. And here's one. And this right here is going to be a bond AC. And this is the bond that connects one carbohydrate, a monosaccharide, to another. And this is called a glycosidic linkage. Glycosidic linkage. So I have this little purple bond just to show what's going to happen. Typical dehydration synthesis. So dehydration synthesis. So when these models combine, some water has to come out. So let's do this. So here's the OH right here. And then I'm going to take off here. You can always show water being produced. And you'll see this in all the videos I do for this dehydration synthesis with the molecules. So here it is. This is a disaccharide. In particular, it's actually maltose, which is a uh, sugar that you see in malt sugars and stuff like that. So that's pretty much the first one. I'm going to do a video for uh, lipids and proteins. For nucleic acids, I, we're going to do like a more of a, the PowerPoints, but I'll also show you the, what the model actually looks like. So that's the first of a couple. And the whole idea is build a molecule or break it. Biosynthesis or di digestion and all this. So all right, next video is coming.